time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. You know just where it's at. Right down there. Right down there. And it's time to follow my Instagram. It's deeply Amanda. G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. It's the same on Twitter. Make sure to follow me there too. And it's time to get this season review started. I am on season eight of the Mahabharat, and I know this is the best season so far because why my Gartrapati enters it. Oh yes, she does. And I've done some reactions before, you know, of her, but you know, after watching this, I feel a lot different. I can see it like, it's a different experience. Actually, no one what's going on. <laughs> Imagine that. When we left off season seven, the Pandavas, they done escaped the fire. They're out there in hiding up in the forest. Don't want nobody to know they're alive. And I don't blame them. I don't blame them. My Arjun needs to be protected. He needs to be protected. And, you know, and, and Kunti and all that. And she's sad. But those five boys, they're they're so good to their mother. They always just cheer her up and make her happy. I love them. I'll tell you who I don't like is that Pad. Why is he so mean? Like he's, he's done gone so crazy. That he's done kidnap some sages and and wants to, and torturing them because he wants them to make him have a son. I remember when the Pandu he done accidentally killed the sage and he went and was repenting in the forest and in exile and and trying to you know make up for his his mistake for years and years. Just for accidentally do it. And there's Drapad. He's done kidnapped him and tortured him. Torture a sage. You you done for. And he could tortured a bunch. So much that they had to some of them escaped into the forest. Of course my Arjun finds him. My Arjun finds him and, and they clean him up and, and feed him and take care of him. That's how my Pandavas are. That's how they are. Drapad. He's done kidnapped him torture them all this but then he like gets rewarded for it because two of the sages was like okay fine we'll give you a son but you have to accept a daughter too because they're good she's gonna change the world and we all know that we all know Drapati is is gonna be his son and or his daughter and gonna change stuff change the course of everything but why was he rewarded for this he he gets a son because he tortured sages I don't agree with that. Mm -mm. I don't like him. And I really don't like him when we see what he does with Drupati. I really don't like him then. But before we get to that, let's talk about the pandemic over there trying to help the sages and get them, you know, to some uh, some village and taken care of and, and back to safety because what the Drupad did. And But they're also trying to stay in hiding. And they're like, only two people know what we look like in this town. It was Drupad and then the, the boy with the stone on the head. So, of course, who finds him, <laughs> or almost finds him, comes galloping on the horses. It's the, the one with the stone in the head, Drona's son. And so, of course, they have to hide. And then those sages, they're like, those sages don't know what to do. They're like, well, we had five boys and their mom here. I don't know where they went, <laughs> you know? Those sages don't know what's going on. But anyway, there's the Pandavas on the run again because they're chasing them. And then they get into this forest that's owned by like the ogres or something. Like they can't escape the forest. It's like a big puzzle maze. So my all my Pandavas, they never, they never have good luck when it comes to stuff. They're always given challenges. But you know what? Challenges is what makes gives you character. It's true. Always, if you have if you have an easy life, you ain't gonna gain character from that. They always got the challenges, and that's why they're such good guys. Hard the Pandavas. Back to the Drupad and his mean old self. Because they're going to have the little fire ceremony to give him a son and everything. And he's just giving everything, ain't he? He's like, take my best armor for my son. Take this. Take take everything to give me the best son. And he was all happy. They had the big fire, and here's his son. I forget his name, but... He don't talk much anyway. And here he is and, oh, my son. And then he, and then he's going to be like, I'm done. And they're like, and the sages up there like, you, you promise to give an offering because 
to get a son, you're supposed to have a daughter. Oh, no, I don't want no daughter. I'm done. I was like, there he is. Go behind her back on his word. That's what you get for working with the mean guy. That's what you get. You should have known he was torturing your sages. And then you're going to reward him with a son. Fire shouldn't let him know. <laughs> That fire, whoever, the gods in that fire, it made that bolt and it came down and it went around him like, oh, you ain't going nowhere, Drew Pan. You ain't going nowhere. So he had to go back up there and he was mad. And he gave that poor offerings. Oh, he he was like, why, why would you even want to do that? All right, you don't want to have a daughter, fine. But why would you even have a daughter to make her life miserable? You giving all the offerings to make, you make, you are making her have the worst life. But what I say about building character, because, I mean, it pays off in the end when you meet her. But before we get to that, I had reacted on her birth scene before. And then watching it again, I was like, I feel it's a whole new experience. After knowing what's going on and, and the emotions and everything, it's a whole new experience. So I was like, let's, let's react to it again in this in this little review so you already get this started this is drapati's birth scene let's go <laughs> mm. and there's the sister sisters always just look like she she wants to say stuff but her eyes are just always like that isn't it? look at see there's her eyes she's like, That's when that fire. See, there's that fireball. You ain't going nowhere, Japan. You think you're gonna, you just gonna get? We gave you a son, and you're just gonna walk off and 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 do what you want with him? Oh no! You better come here and give your offerings. Because I know just how mean he is to her. Mm. He ain't right to you. Her potty deserves a better father. She deserves someone to love her. Oh. How beautiful she is. Oh, why am I tearing up because of this? Because I just, my heart breaks for her. She's so beautiful. I don't even want to see this because I know she wants to go to her father and look at her. She's, she's respect and love to her father and he just tosses her away. I do not like him. Drapati deserves someone to love and, and, and be there for. And she got it a little bit, didn't she? Like that sister that I was just talking about that always like, she never hardly says nothing, but her face is always like that. He <laughs> did her face always like that. It's always. <laughs> her sister was there for her. Brought her back, showed her the ways brought her to a little chamber, set her up, you know. That sister's a good person. And and then there's Drupad doing her wrong. Drupad's doing her wrong too. She was always in charge of the, the army and all this and he's just like, you're fired. You're fired. We're got, I got a son now. He don't have no experience with the armies. He don't have, he was just born out the fire. You think he's got all this kind of wartime experience? I don't. I don't, maybe, maybe he does because that's what the fire gift gave him. But I mean, how how can you just do that to one of your children? I don't get it. And she was like, they're uh, devoted. They're all devoted to him. And he's just going to throw away the girls like that. He's going to get his one day. I don't know how because I don't know what happens to him. And don't tell me. I don't want no spoilers. But I just know he's going to get his. That right there, that's karma. You love me some Drew Potty. Oh, with the way she is, like, with the little children, that just shows right there. That's Those scenes show what a good heart she has because they're all the, the, the assistants and, and the handmaids or whatever they call them. They're like, oh, no, kids, don't talk to her. She's a princess. No, no. And she's just like, 
let me see your doll. Like she just has such an innocent soul and she's like, I'll be your friend. And ah, uh, why? I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I am because just the face she has in store for her. I know it's going to be heartache and, and it was all caused because of the Drew Pad and, and the dad. And I, and she just such a pure hearted loving soul. It just, it breaks my heart to know. It does. It just breaks my heart to know what they do to her. And it breaks my heart what they do to her sister. What's her name? Sh Shakande? Shakande or something? I mean, that was her life doing, you know, being the general of the army. And then they're going to rip that away from her. She was going to kill herself. I was like, don't do that. Oh, no, you have. I'm glad Drapati was there to stop it. And Drapati don't care. Like, that girl, she's quiet. She don't want to say nothing. She's scared of that Drew pad. Just doing her eye. Like, always, you know, like that. But she don't say nothing. Oh, Drapati, she, uh-uh. Drapati was like, this ain't right. I'm going to go talk to father. She, <laughs> she marched up in there. And she was like, this ain't right. What you doing, Dad, Father? And and you should make her general, and she's worthy in this. And then his mean old self. Like, you you gotta know. That you should expect it. You should expect it. His mean old self just get out of here, exiled her. She just got there. You haven't even. Would she spend one night there? And and then you're gonna exile her. <sighs> he's a mean, He's gonna get his. I just keep saying that karma's gonna get him some way or another. But I mean, that's how it ended. She's in exile. And there's that little girl that she became friends with that was there to help, you know, to give her a little support and talking to. It just, it just breaks my heart. So I enjoyed this season a lot. I mean, because Drupati entered it. I, that was like the number one reason. Pandava's over there. They're stuck in the forest. I don't know what's going to happen over there. But it was kind of an emotional one because... Is this going to be the rest of the season I'm going to get emotional like this? Because nothing seems to go the way I want it. That, that's how I feel. I get upset because nothing goes the way I want it. I need some retribution. I need I need the Pandavas to, to get their revenge. <laughs> I need I need somebody to, to, to love Draupadi and give her the love that she deserves and treat her good. Maybe it'll come. Maybe it'll come. But don't give me. Don't tell me. I don't want to know spoilers, la, 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 don't tell me. But let me know what y'all think, comments and thumbs and all that. Until next time, y'all.